Well, hello and welcome. This is Nate, and I got uh, this really unique floor plan in this one. This one is straight out of the magazine. That is what's called the magazine. So, yeah, this one should be belong in a magazine. But uh, I am at Pratt Homes here in Tyler, Texas. And they've got this really nice, like I said, unique floor plan. You walk in, you're not looking straight into your kitchen. You're not looking straight into your dining room. You're looking only at your living room. Yeah. Wait till you see, oh, hey, you can see the tub. Yeah, wait till you see the bathroom in this one. Trust me, you're going to like it. Three bedroom, two bath. I did forget the square footage on it, but you can see this is a large home. Now we do have the vinyl siding on it. Of course, you can change the colors if you like. You can get different colors. You've got the tin roof. Yeah, so you can see the tub in that corner too. <laughs> so keep in mind, you got lots of options with this home. Might even be able to get full sheetrock. Now it is sheetrock in all your living spaces. So your closets and your bedrooms are the wallboard. Other than that, this is an all sheetrock home. So just real brief here on the back side. Got some windows right here in your living room. We've got the sliding glass door off your dining room. So there's your front door. Right off your front door you have a closet. So you have like a little foyer area when you first walk in, giving you your, co your coat closet right as you walk in. And now we can turn around. And there is the view you get as soon as you walk in. So you're not looking at the dining room, kitchen, none of that stuff. Really nice built-ins on both sides of your uh, TV stand and fireplace. Yep, you've got the electric fireplace. And I really like this stonework here. So you can see how big, see I didn't even get to this side, so your living room comes basically all the way back to where that cabinet is. So if I stand where the cabinet is and show you your living room, 
Look at all that space. All your vents are in the ceilings here. Okay, now let's turn around. So we've got our plug in the end of your island here. And just take a look at how big this island is. I mean, there's your standard cabinets right there. So standard size cabinets with three drawers there. Then you've got your black porcelain sink with the sprayer faucet, the dishwasher, and then another set of full-size cabinets right here. I mean, that is a huge island. <laughs> really long island. To complement this side of the kitchen with all these cabinets in your, I mean, I told you you had a lot of cabinets. And these stainless steel Whirlpool appliances. Now these are non-adjustable shelves as you can see. Really nice countertops here. And I like this little deal they did above the stove. Now see, we've got open cabinet here. You've got your wine glasses, your brandy glasses. We've got an open cabinet over here. Then you can stack some stuff in there. Tiny little plates in that one. And then a whole lot more counter space over here. Now these are going to be essentially your pantry cabinets. Because I do not believe that there is a pantry. Now I didn't check out the utility room that well before I walked in. But I don't remember seeing a pantry in there. Hence the reason why you have so many cabinets here. And now if you need, like if you want your family to come over for the holidays and you need a lot of table space, look at how much space you have here. I mean, that table is tiny in comparison. So you could easily fit a four or five man, six man table here, another one over here so that the whole family can sit in the dining room while you're having Thanksgiving, Christmas dinner, your New Year celebration while y'all are over playing, say what, Cards, of, Cards Against Humanity I think is the big popular one for New Year's. With the sliding glass door. You got in your vaulted ceiling here, this beam that runs the whole length of this section of the home. Like you can't hardly see the end of that. <laughs> That's how long this thing is. And our utility room is back over here. See, I just kind of glanced here. I saw that door over there. I didn't really go in. There is your pantry. Your furnace is right there. Water heater straight ahead. And we do have a pantry. A big one at that. <laughs> so see, you got all those cabinets out there and this really big pantry. To the left from this direction is our, first off, our guest bathroom. 
Nice big counter in here. I really like when they use these longer counters, gives you some space. And we've got the shower tub combo. Now this one doesn't have that really big tub in it. That may be an option that you can get. And then into the bedroom here. Now they don't have the lights in the bedroom, so the fixture's there, but they just don't have any lights in them. So our master bedroom is on the other side of that wall. And you get a large bedroom here. So we've got two windows on this wall over here. Let's see if I can get back enough to show you. There we go. So two windows on this side. So we have two closets in our master bathroom. First one being here with all the trim supplies in it. Now this one isn't small by any means. So this is the smaller of the two closets. Your other closet is back this way. And this is the really big walk-in closet. Your uh, water closet. So we'll just go ahead and get the tub out of the way here since it's kind of right in the corner. And you saw it as we were walking through right there and walking through right there. So really nice big deep tub. And then we've got our counter space over here with the dual sinks. Stack of drawers at each end. And hello Raiden. Cabinets up here also. And we still get a tile shower. Oh, I can't open it. They got it. They got her bolted shut. <laughs> so anyway, really nice gray tile in there.
Looks really good. Got the polished chrome for your fixtures in there. And with that, how about y'all polish up on those comments down below? What do you think of this floor plan? I like the fact that it's it's open, but it's all this way. You don't see everything when you first walk in. So let me know in the comments down below what you think of it. You know, you got this nice built in here. And while you're there, make sure the subscription button is gray. Notifications are turned on, so that way you get notified when I upload videos. Thanks for watching, and I'll be back with some price information, and have a good evening. Well, hello, and welcome. We got to get into some price information, but uh, Raven's got to tell you, look at him sporting the, the rival team there for the Super Bowl. But anyway, we got to get into some price information, but like I said, Raiden wants to uh, tell you all about what we're doing tonight. We're going to see someone in real life. I am so excited. Who are we going to see? You told him. But we're supposed to tell them. What are we going to what? We got Peanut. You got Ahmed. You got Jose Jalapeno on a stick. And they're all voiced over by who? Jeff Donald. How can you not remember his name when he's like one of your favorite people? So anyway, so now we got to get into the price information. So this is a 2063 square foot. It is called the magazine located at Pratt Homes. Now this one is a manufactured home, not a modular. So that's gonna make the price a little bit, a little bit better. So this one comes in at between 75 to $100 a square foot. So that'll make it a really good price. Now, I really like this home. Hope you all really liked it and make sure you're down there hitting the like button, hitting the subscribe button, hitting the notification bell. That way you get notified when I upload videos. Share the video with all your friends and family. Post on Facebook, you know, wherever you feel like posting it, uh, Twitter. I will see you in the next one. Thanks for watching and have a good day. Bye.